we found another um, caliputter that already hatched and it's big. a little bit. See that white stuff? White stuff right there. So last year at school, Dylan learned about the life cycle. And one of the examples they used was monarch butterflies. And so earlier this year, we went out trying to find some milkweed plants because that apparently is where the monarchs like to lay their eggs. I think we not, might not find a milkweed plant. These were almost at the end of the trail. Yeah, it doesn't really look like our property has any milkweed on it. We weren't able to find any milkweed plants earlier this year, but now that we're a month or so into summer, we found that this whole field here is actually full of milkweed plants. So we went out today to see if we couldn't find some eggs. It's kind of hard to tell the difference between um, like the sap, the milk sap that just kind of dries off here. You can see that this is just kind of the milk sap that dried off and an actual egg. Um, even that little, even this little guy here, it kind of looks like it might be an egg, but the eggs are have a pointy tip. And if you look really close, they actually have little ridges. Like even that, you would think that would probably be a monarch butterfly egg, but there's no tip and I also don't see any ridges on it. So it looks like it's just a uh, sap. They said that sometimes they lay it on the top. So maybe check the top of the leaves. But most of the time they're underneath the leaves. Why? I don't know. Okay, so I just found an egg. But this is the egg right here. And it's kind of, it's, like I said, it's kind of hard to tell, but it's kind of pointy. It's like a pointy top. So check this out here. This plant actually has a little caterpillar on it. This is the first time I've seen this. See it? Where do you find it? Right here. It's so small. We found a we found another um caliper already hatched and it's big. Whoa, okay, so maybe that's what they get when they get a little bit bigger. Mom, found a bigger one. This is cool. 